Hey! Raindrop, drip, drop top, drop top, smoking on cooking the hot box. Cookin'. On your bitch, she a dot dot dot. Cooking up in the crock pot pot. We came from nothing to something. Hey! I don't try nobody to grit the trick. Nobody call up the gang and they come and get you. This video, I want to let you know that I'll be going to uh, Orlando, Florida. I'll be attending the um, Orlando Toy and Comic Convention hosted by Mike's Comics Awesome Store. So you gotta check them out and also check out Orlando Toy and Comic Con if you guys are out in the area. Um, and say what's up to me if you guys see me there. So um, yeah, let's get on to the video, guys. What's up guys, welcome to 2017, and um, I'm going to show you a little bit of the haul I've gotten so far. It's going to be a hashtag broke gang year. Um, it's been pretty uh, crazy so far. I've got a lot of good stuff, um, hopefully a lot more stuff to find in 2017. But um, yeah, let me uh, go ahead and show you some of the stuff I've gotten so far. Um, so first, if you follow me on Instagram, you're going to see that I picked up this Joker. I'm not really a fan of DC Comics, the Multiverse uh, series, but I picked up this Joker from the Suicide Squad. Um, it's pretty sick. Look at like, if you can see it, you can see all the uh, the tattoos and whatnot, and the, he has a gun and a knife. But it's a cool figure. It's not bad. Um, it's not as bad as the Harley Quinn, man. That Harley Quinn, the head sculpt, I don't know what's going on with that. But yeah, this was on sale for $15, was it $14.98, whatever, $15. It was on sale for $14.98, so I had to pick it up. Um, I think they have the uh, Deadshot. The Deadshot was on sale, too. Um, I might pick that up. I'm not sure yet. I'm probably going to wait for the Hot Toys version. And um, I know it's going to be like $300 more, but it's well worth it. If you guys collect Hot Toys, let me know. Put it in the comment section below. Um, it's well worth to get into the Hot Toys realm, but, you know, it's a, man, that's a bigger black hole than anything else. They're like reaching out $300 plus figures. But anyways, I keep, keep sidetracking. Um, so yeah, there's the Joker. The side, the side, uh, Suicide Squad Joker. Pretty cool. And um, something else I got. I got this bad boy right here. This is the Hulkbuster Jada, uh, Jada Toys. I don't know I said Jada Toys. This is the Jada Toys Metals Diecast Hulkbuster. This is a 6.5 inch figure. Um, it has the uh, 2.5 inch Iron Man, and the cool thing about it, this 2.5 inch Iron Man, this actually fits inside the Hulkbuster, and that's freaking awesome, awesome guys. Um, it's like the new, um, what is it, the Titanfall 2 uh, Funko Pop, um, those fit inside as well, but you know, this has a way better paint job than any of the, uh, any of the uh, Funko Pops do. This is die cast, and the paint jobs are amazing, it looks like a car, car paint job, so it's pretty cool. So that's the Hulkbuster, um, and I'm a big fan of the Age of Ultron um, series, so um, yeah, um, check it out guys. If you guys see this at your store, make sure you pick it up, it's an awesome figure. And if you guys want me to open any of these, um, I can definitely do that in another video. So just let me know in the comment section below. And another one I'm pretty pretty happy to get for 2017. This is the uh, Marvin the Martian uh, with Rocket Pop Ride. This thing is freaking sick, guys. I've never seen um, the uh, Pop Rides go this detailed, and um, I'm a big fan of the uh, Marvin the Martian, the Duck Dodger series, um, you know, Space Cadet and K-9 and whatnot, and I'm a, a big fan of the movie Space Jam, so yeah, there it is, guys. This is the uh, Marvin the Martian with Rocket Pop Ride. And then, um, I was, I was, if you saw yesterday on my Instagram, I pick up this. Yes, it's the Hatchimals. I don't know too much about it, but this is like the toy of the year for 2016. So I had to pick one up. Um, I'm not sure if I'm actually going to hatch this or not. Or I might just hold on to it. I don't know. But there it is, Hatchimals. And um, let me get on to the uh, Funko Pops. I know you guys have been waiting for that. Uh, so the first Funko Pop I've got for uh, 2017 is uh, from the uh, Jessica Jones Netflix show. This is Luke Cage. What an awesome show. It's not the Luke Cage show, but this is um still a, Luke Cage is an awesome show on Netflix also. Um, so within this line, you'll get Luke Cage, and then you also get Jessica Jones, if you can see that there. Um, so he's cool. There's, there he is, Luke Cage. Uh, what else did I get, guys? I also got this one. This is the, uh, I don't really collect um, Hanna-Barbera. Um, but this one I had to get. This is a uh, Snagglepuss. 
This one is a big part of my history, uh, well, my childhood memories. So they have Snagglepuss. Um, there's Chase versions for all of these new um, Hanna-Barbera, the uh, pop animation lines. They have Chase versions for everything. I mean, they have pa Chase versions for like Hot Topic exclusives, um, which uh, I bet it's gonna be really hard. I think it's the Joker, and that's gonna be ridiculous to try to get that one. But anyways, here's Snagglepuss. Um, it has Adam Ant, um, part of the series. It has El Cabon. Um, that's a specialty series Funko Pop. So that one's um, it's out now. I saw that one out. And they have Wally Gator, and then uh, was it Touche Turtle? So that's another one. So that's that. Let's see what else I got. And this one, this one, I'm so excited. Uh, this is from the new Power Rangers movie. This is the new um, their new suits. So these these are pretty cool. I'm excited to see the movie, guys. Um, let me know if you're excited. If uh, you're actually going to be going out to see the movie as well. I'm a big MMPR, which is a Mighty Morphin Power Rangers fan. So I'm excited to see that, um, see this movie and see how these new suits are in uh, the uh, big picture. But um, so far, all the toys have been look really crappy. I had the uh, Morpher, uh, that was pretty crappy. I returned it, it was just all gray and it's not that great. But um, yeah, a lot of the toys don't look that great, but these pops actually look pretty nice. So here's the Pink Ranger guys, pretty sick. So of course they have the black, pink, yellow, blue, red, and they have Rita, which is the Hot Topic exclusive. I'm pretty excited for that one. And did you guys see that Goldar that's coming out? Man, that looks ugly as hell. I don't know what's going on there. It looks like, uh, I think P2 said it looks like cheese or something like that. But that thing looks ugly. I don't know why they designed it like that. But, um, sorry I'm ranting. But look at this suit though, um, doesn't it look like they uh, combined it with the uh, Iron Man suits? I don't know, something like that, like organic combined with Iron Man, Tony Stark series, who knows. But anyways, that's the Pink Ranger, pretty cool. The only one I wasn't able to get was the Yellow Ranger, um, but I did end up ordering that on HotTopic.com, they had it online. And then I got the Red Ranger, which is pretty cool. The Red Ranger is probably one of my favorite suits from the uh, new Power Rangers um, uh, movie, the movie line series. It's pretty cool. Check that out. And I got the Black Ranger, which is also nice. Um, you know, the Mastodon does not look like a Mastodon at all. I've seen the toy at um, at Target. Was it Target? That thing does not look <laughs> doesn't look good at all. But anyways, yeah, here's the Black Ranger. Pretty cool. And then I got the Blue Ranger. So here's the Blue Ranger guys, which is pretty cool. Not bad at all. So there's the Blue Ranger guys. So I guess we'll see what happens when the movie comes out. We'll see how good these uh, new Power Rangers are. But um, that's pretty much it guys for um, my first part of the haul for 2017. I got a few hot toys coming in, but I'm gonna save that for another video. Uh, I'm gonna save that for my collector's room, which is in uh, Orlando. So uh, I'm gonna be traveling to Orlando again on the uh, 17th. So I'm excited I get rid of this uh, nasty weather outside. I think it's gonna snow today, so not looking forward to that. But um, again, thanks for watching, guys. And thank you to all my subscribers. Um, congratulations to the winner of the 100 subscriber giveaway. You're awesome, man. Thanks for participating. And uh, just keep watching, guys. Um, I got a lot more in store for this year. Um, so, hope you guys continue to watch, and um, again, happy hunting, guys, and have a good one. Peace.